What's up my friends, Robert here. Historical moment. My first banana bunch is ready for harvest. Can you see it up there? Uh, uh. <laughs> After nearly two years, 2013, February 27th, I think I planted this. Uh, this is my first banana plant. And it's an ice cream banana. And uh, <laughs> I just had a couple and it's, it's, uh, it's so good. It's amazing. So, fully organic, no spraying, just um, compost and natural, uh, you know, food scraps and whatnot, um, manures and stuff, all natural uh, fertilizers, no synthetics, no spraying. So, yeah. So, this is gonna be my first harvest. I have my little uh, hand saw here. I'm just gonna cut the banana plant in half leave the bottom there because I've heard it's better if you leave the leave the plant there because it breaks down slowly and it, it's gonna provide nutrients for uh, for the other uh, plants so yeah let's let's give that a shot So what do you guys think, huh? Take a look at these guys, huh? Oh, some of them are exploding already. Ah, and the green ones on the bottom. It's not a huge bunch. It's about eight hands. So like 80 to 100 bananas. All right. So, ready for the taste test? Yeah, let's do it. Let me pick a right one, a nice one. All right. So this is my first banana. Actually, I had a few, but I'm gonna pretend it's the first one. <laughs> so this is the ice cream banana, guys. Hmm. It's amazing. It's hard to describe. In the middle it's, uh, it has a little bit of uh, orange, uh, orange in the middle, and it has some black in the middle because it has some seeds. I don't know if you can see the seeds; they are tiny. Mmm. No, it's sweet. It's creamy. The texture it's a bit different than the regular bananas. It's a bit firmer, not that soft. Although this is really ripe. Look at the skin, it's just so thin. Hmm. So yeah. The project is successful, I can say. You know? If I can grow one bunch of tasty bananas, I can grow a thousand. So this is just the beginning. I'm gonna grow so many bananas. <laughs> I have 15 edible varieties. So in a couple of years, there's gonna be thousands of bananas here. And it's not gonna be a monoculture. There's gonna be papayas, guavas, avocados, you know, veggies and, uh, you know, sun hemp, nitrogen fixers, sweet potatoes. It's still gonna be a polyculture garden kind of permaculture style but I'm gonna have to focus on uh, on production for two reasons one the 
the government is pushing me and the other I kind of want to prove it that you can grow enough food for a family on five acres and you can live off the land so yeah and I also have some some bigger plans for the near future I uh, am planning to purchase a larger farm like 100 120 acre farm but that's down the road probably end of this year or maybe next year and waiting for the government to release the rules for jobs act title 3 equity crowdfunding so I can raise money uh, basically shareholders small shareholders not just accredited investors all right thanks for watching and uh, yeah I'll see you soon.